hello friends in this video i will show you how to use webity vulnerability scanner tool in kali linux so let's get started you can start the webity tool either by going to the menu section and then to the web application analysis click here and this is webity click here and webity tool will get started or you can simply type webity in your command prompt then this will this this tool you can access this tool by typing webity in the command prompt so let me show you first its help menu so type webity space hyphen h so this is its uh, help menu the important thing to look for is this hyphen u uh, parameter so you can enter the url by using this hyphen u parameter and you can specify particular modules using this hyphen m module if you want to use some proxy then you can use this uh, hyphen p url and if you want to use the tor proxy you can use double dash tor parameter to to protect uh, to hide your identity and let me show you the main page of webpt so as you can see webpt allows you to audit the security of your web applications so it is a web application vulnerability scanner in python so you can read more by going through this uh, manual page of webpt tool so those who want to read more can read the um uh, let me show you how to use this tool all you have to do is type webpt hyphen u then you have to enter the url of your target website so since in my case i am running a utility on my local system so i will type its url 192.168.56.1 utd d and now press enter so it is as simple as this you can use this webity vulnerability scanner very easily now all you have to do is wait and watch this uh, scanner will scan this website and list all the vulnerabilities in a report when the when this tool is done with the scanning part it will generate a report in which it will mention all the vulnerabilities it has found in the target website so just wait for it to finish its scanning this tool is taking time so let me pause the video i will resume the video again once it is done with the scanning part
as you can see that uh, property vulnerability scanner has completed its uh, scanning and uh, let me show you what tests it has performed so as you can see it is it has tested http headers it has test, tested cookie flags it has checked sql sql injection so it has tried try to find xss in the website and i think i think uh, this tool has successfully found xss vulnerability and uh, it has tried to perform a blind sql injection as well so at the end it has generated a report here so let us open this report and see what is there so i will i will copy this path and i will open it type firefox and then paste selection and then press enter so as you can see webpt has generated a vulnerability report so it has found a blind sql injection vulnerability it has found a content security policy config configuration vulnerability and uh, as you can see it has found two sql injection vulnerability it has found cross site scripting vulnerabilities and uh, so these are the vulnerabilities this scanner has found and uh, it has mentioned each each uh, vulnerability in great detail you can read more about the these vulnerabilities in uh, in the page below if you scroll down so this is one of the tools which you can use to scan your websites and uh, do try this tool which is given in uh, kali linux so it's a good vulnerability scanner so that's all for this video if you got to learn something from this video then don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel thanks for watching this video